day one of my personal uh, modified booktubeathon 2014 went pretty well I would say. Um, I didn't get as much reading done as I wanted to because I took a lot of breaks and in hindsight I probably shouldn't have done that but my night is not over it's only like nine o'clock here so I'm gonna keep reading through the night and um, as I'm uploading because it takes me like four hours to upload and I'm kind of dreading it's gonna be a long night. It's gonna be a long night. Um, and I'm going to be limiting my uh, amount of sleep in order to get this all done. Like I said, I did a pretty good job today. I, I'm i very proud of my progress, um, wh you know, where I am in this. Today I went and completed one task. I read a book that has pictures in it, and that was Moss by Art Spiegelman. I I guess I, like I'm gonna say in my little uh, description of this video, there's no spoilers in my uh, videos for this week. Um, I'm not really going to go into discussions of my books. I will make separate reviews for um, the books that I read, except for I think this one. Um, I'm just gonna say in this video that I really like this book. Um, it was really interesting and um, I liked the way that the story is being told, kind of a first-hand account of the Holocaust and the events which this man and his wife go through to survive the Holocaust. Um, and I will be picking this up probably pretty soon after this week um, to read Moss 2, um, the second book, and see where it continues because they end up in Auschwitz and... I want to see where it goes from there, how they survive that. The artwork is fantastic and I love the way that, that you are seeing the author uh, interview his father and getting the story that way. Um, it kind of gives it more of a like, you're sitting in the room with him and hearing the story also at the same time. I'm giving this book a 4 out of 5 stars. The second book that I have started today is The Hunt by... Andrew Faduka, and I've gotten like 59 pages in. Um, I, like I said, I took a couple breaks that I probably shouldn't have today, which kind of slowed me down when I started reading this book, but um, I really am enjoying this book, and I'm, like I said, it's only like 9 o'clock as I'm as I speak, it's only like nine something. So I've got the rest of tonight to continue reading this book. I'm gonna definitely get through. Uh, I'm gonna say mo almost the rest of this book. Hopefully by the time I go to bed tonight. Um, and yeah, I, I'm really enjoying this book. This is really um, this is really a book that I kind of just bought in a whim, um, not knowing anything about other than um, it's some kind of. Hunger Games-esque kind of a story, and, um, and with vampires, that's just all I knew. Um, and I didn't really know if I was gonna like it, but I really am liking this book, and I like where this is going. I find the main character very interesting, and the world very interesting. I'm very excited to keep reading this book. Like I said, I'll probably get through a good chunk of it tonight. Maybe the rest of it? Maybe, maybe I could do that. I think maybe. But if I, if I just continue reading solid, I might be able to finish this tonight. It's my goal. My goal. We'll see if it happens. That's where I am right now. Um, yeah, I need to not take so many breaks. Um, but I've got a good week ahead of me where I'm gonna, you know, not doing anything, and I have no commitments this week. And except, well, except for one day, but that's it. Yeah, I I, I st stocked up at the grocery store the other day, so that I didn't have to go grocery shopping this week. So I have no errands to do, which is really good. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna be super tired tomorrow. I think I bit off more than I could chew. And I was thinking about this like earlier today. The challenges say to read a book that has pictures in it, and a, and then another one says to read a book that has red on it. I could have. Boom. That was two of my challenges, and I was stupid and picked a book that had red on it and a picture that had pictures. I... So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.